Hello and welcome back to another episode of Low IQ. Jack Hello. is with me. I am with you as always. Jack, why have, have, have we done anything to the set today? Have we done anything to the set? Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't oh, know. the tiger is moved. here. Yeah. That's moved. But also... Um, there is an also. We've got another chair. Ooh. Do you know why, Jack? Uh, I don't know. You tell me why. <laughs> we have two guests back in the studio today. Ooh. James and Fu. Say hi. Well, go on. Hi. Yo. Second time. Is this... This we second done? time, yeah, yeah, yeah. Second, second time, time back. Time. Second time, New yeah. studio, what do you think? Nice, man. Much nicer than the last one. Yeah. Do you think? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Why? Yeah. Why? Well, Because it's one, yours. Do you remember, yeah, remember yeah. last time your producer didn't even know your names? She knew our names. Did she? Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, whoa, fuck off. Whoa, yeah, yeah. whoa, whoa. Yeah, didn't remember that until you said it. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. Wait, yeah. yeah, But she wasn't the actual producer. Who was, which one was it? Was yeah, but you go, you, you regulate in that building. Yeah. So that, that's true. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah. That, doesn't say, we, that doesn't bode well with your brand. Yeah, I've never been there before. But, but yeah, all right. Second time you've been on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You came on when we were like, we didn't have many listeners as well. Mm. We still don't have that many. To be fair, and he's, he's Not still compared back. to you guys. You're like third in the world, second in the world or some shit. World. That's insane. That's not. No, you are. Really right? right? Where's that? In the I world. Said, you told me that, Matt, didn't you? Probably. They're like third in the world. Yeah. Third in England, maybe. Oh, probably at some point. Or well, third know. in London. It goes. Right? In London. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I was just doing all right. Mm. Doing crazy, yeah. It's doing, your clips always do well as well, don't they? And I saw uh, you were performing at the O2. Are you, is are that indeed. the we big O2? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's oh, crazy. Yeah. yeah, you know what pissed me off? Um, <clears throat> I went, you know, when I went to see um, Barber the other day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was, I went to see a new Barber the other day and he was asking about shows and stuff. And then he was like, oh, what's the next show? And I was like, oh, it's at the O2. And he immediately, without, when I say immediately, like without taking a breath, I was like, Indigo, yeah? <laughs> I was like, why would you assume? Wow. Why would you assume it's fucking indigo? Wow. Wait, so how many shows are you doing there? Just the one. Just the one. And like, how many seats? 15,000. 15,000. 15, Fuck, and you think you're going to sell all that shit out? It's done. It's pretty you much done, yeah. Fuck, yeah. that's really? levels, yeah. I think bro. It's like 200 left. Yeah. I don't that. think we could fill out a pub. <laughs> <laughs> no, we couldn't. Definitely not. No, I think man. you'll be very, very surprised. Do you think? Yeah, I think you'll be you very guys, surprised. For sure. You guys are hilarious people, bro. Oh, yeah. Bro. And I'm, I'm right, not even saying that, that, that because we're on the show. You guys are no. fucking hilarious. To be fair, so, actually, uh, in one of our recent shows, uh, we did a ranking podcast, ranking UK podcast, and okay. we said you were the top. 10 out of 10 we gave you. Yeah? Wow. Yeah, we did. Wow. No, 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 did we? I think. <laughs> no, I, 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 no, I think we said 9.5. Don't no. blow their egos too much, mate. Fair. Thank you, guys. No, but yeah, you, appreciate you, it. You obviously, no. you're the, you've you been doing it for ages anyway. How long have you been doing it for? Four, four and, and a half. bit. Yeah, four and a half years. Yeah. See, that's it, it, it's not that even long, that long. That long mm. For how no, big you are now, it's crazy. And we were saying before you got it, it's like crazy because you got like Joe Rogan and shit. He was famous before, but yeah, your sure. podcast was like, the thing you didn't do all that shit. Yeah, before. we didn't do no, anything. Didn't before, no. Mm, no. Mm. How cool. old are you boys again? 33. 32, 33. What are you doing for when's your birthdays? Mine has gone February 17th. What did you do for it? I was away. Where did you go? Ooh. Went to Egypt and I went to Miami. What the fuck is this? <laughs> yeah, <what's that? laughs> this is interrogation. <laughs> well, no, I'm just, just asking. You went to Egypt and Miami. Yeah, yeah. Right. I've heard Egypt yeah. is really uh fucked for haggling ya. Not haggling ya, but like mm. bounded like Thing in you, you know. I know what you're mugging trying to say. You. Not, yeah, not yeah, mugging yeah. you, but what, what's it? What's it? What's, 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 uh, say something. The there. tourist what is it? trap thing. Yeah. Yes, tourist trap. Like form of harassment. Yeah, that's what it is. Like form of harassment. Yeah. Um. Yeah. 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 Standard. But I get, stayed. I stayed pretty much in like the resort area for a while, so I wasn't really getting huggled that much. Did but you see happens, the though. pyramids? No, that wasn't Cairo. I didn't stay in Cairo. What did you say? Um, Hagada. It's a different. It's like south of Egypt. Did you not go, James? You didn't go with your boy. No, we went to Miami. I went to Miami. Mm. We went to Miami. What was that like? Sick. Insane. I want to go yeah. to Miami. It's like, uh, that's like GTA. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Literally. yeah. Literally Vice City, bro. You see, yeah, yeah, yeah. Really? Literally yeah, yeah. Vice City. Yeah, Is everyone like proper NPCs? I feel like when Depends I see videos. You know. LA's you know. more like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. See? like from the car, LA is very much like, as soon as you get out of the airport in it and you see all the streets, mm -hmm. like the people, the cars, everything is exactly Motorway, like GTA. Yeah. Really? Exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, weird. wow. Yeah. Proper crackheads and shit everywhere. <laughs> crackheads. That's what you call them. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Everywhere. Well, yeah. apparently you walk down the street and there you get them like pissing themselves, pissing on the street. Yeah, I saw sort a of dude take a shit in the street. Yep. We really? A proper yeah, yeah, yeah. shit? Mm. Yeah, that's Man. fucked. Yeah, it's intense. Norm. Not well, is it worth going? Because I, I want to go, but... And well, it's we, cool. It's There's like going. nice places you can say You've got money. Like, you can stay in the nice... <laughs> yeah, come on. <laughs> I don't know. You don't know. It's like the, the higher you go in LA, the, you get away from the... 
<laughs> why why do all the celebrities live there then if it's so like grim because well, it's more like um it's the same with like anything really it's just like theirs is just like a more enhanced version of london like there's shit disgusting parts of london Fair. That everyone true. lives here true so true. it's just exactly the same there it's just like and a bigger city huge and it's huge is it yeah oh, bro. bro you can you can drive from one end like we we went to like one restaurant on the first day and i think it took us like an hour and a half to I get there. I don't even remember. It was at that, um, not, no, not this LA trip, the first LA first trip. LA trip. We went to one Italian restaurant. It took like an hour and a half. There's one I wanted oh, to go. Oh, yes. And it was yes, an hour and a half oh, drive. Yes, and that's yes, like, yes, yes. that's not like London hour and a half, mm. like traffic. It was like M-way. going, like oh, really? driving yeah. for an hour and a half straight, yeah. like 70 miles an hour. And it's, like, you're still in LA. Well, why, why, why don't pick somewhere fucking closer then? One, we didn't know. And then know. two, one holiday, man. Fuck it. Yeah, yeah, but you yeah. must, when you typed it in, it said an yeah, hour and a half. Obviously then at the time. It must have Yeah, but we didn't type it in because like, I just wanted to go there before. I went to, I've heard about this restaurant. It's supposed to be sick. Is it Scopa? Scopa? It's called Scopa. 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 One Italian place. Yeah. It was banging. Mm. Was it? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Expensive. Uh, it wasn't too bad. It was actually on Joe Rogan. I heard about it. <clears> oh, really? Joe Rogan episode and they were just gassed off it. So I was like, we have to go there. Bro. So I would have gone there if it was two hours, three hours. Okay. Speaking of Joe Rogan, have you heard this shit recently? What's up? About what? Bro, have you heard about this? No. Mate. Right. So he had a guest on like a month or so oh, ago. Oh, the murderer. Bro. Oh, yeah. Bro. Really much about it. it. Bro. Fill me in, Paul. Okay, right. So <laughs> yeah, just spoiled it <laughs> straight up. <laughs> right, <laughs> right, 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 moving on then, I suppose. Uh, no, so he had he had a guest on like a couple months ago, or whatever, yeah. right? And this guy was uh, he was like an ex convict, but he's now he works in like youth centres and all this shit. He's like a big guy for uh, being reformed, okay. And he like teaches people like this is not the way and stuff. And he went on Joe Rogan to talk about like, look, crime is not the way. He used mm -hmm. to be in the Bloods gang or whatever. Mm -hmm. uh, anyway, about a month later, after he was on Joe Rogan's episode, right, uh, someone rings a the police. They're like, I can hear gunshots at in this uh, this apartment in the Bronx, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, the police turn up and uh, they see this guy. They go into his apartment find a decapitated head in his fridge. Jesus yeah. Christ. How yeah. nuts is that? What? This guy, this guy murdered his friend, chopped him up, put him in his freezer. It was his friend? It was his mate, yeah. And then uh, like put his bits in bags and, and the CCTV footage of him, like he tries to get away with it by like putting wigs on and like wearing yeah. different clothes every time he comes in and out of this Shit. apartment. Oh, wow. It's crazy. Damn, bro. Yeah, look, here, look at this. Is that the guy? No, nah, no. Nah. That's the neighbor. <clears throat> Wait. He's his neighbor. Look, he just- Oh, he's just trying to do costumes. And oh, there's wow. this bloke's <laughs> bloody body, body parts in these bags. Oh, bags. And he was wow. on Joe Rogan. Just That's before this happened. Crazy. What, so did he murder? He's wearing a wig. Oh, <laughs> wig shit. What insane. do you expect to have with that? Oh, that can't idea. be him. Well, is it? Well, I don't, was that so? Did he kill him after he went on Joe Rogan? After, before? yeah. Damn. Yeah. What well, did? Crazy. That, but don't you think like you don't know what a person yeah, yeah, is like, like? He just and the thing is, Joe Rogan's episodes are long. They're like three, mm, hours. three hours. Yeah. So like you're spending like a solid three hours. How do you not clock on to that and shit? And then afterwards, you'd, he just went and killed someone. Man, and put his head in his. Yeah. Freezer. There's just, and also there's killing people, and then there's, there's killing, killing people. people yeah. in the fridge. But then That's would like if yes. you were to kill someone, you probably would do that though. I would. Well, well no, no, to get away with it. Yeah. Do you think you could get away with murder? Nah. nah you don't I'll, think I'll so? Overthink it. Nah. Well, I, yeah, I, I reckon. I'll overthink it. Really? Would you? Yeah. I think so. I think it's probably the simple way to do it. Like, just throw him in the river or something. Mm. No, like, no, no, bad. Yeah, true, bad. But I'd think of like the way, I'd probably think of the best way to do it. And then be like, no, 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 they're gonna, they're gonna catch on. They're gonna catch yeah. on. And I think, what, what would they least expect me to do? And it would just be, I'd be sat in my room for weeks. Or oh, the body, body's just rotting. There. <laughs> You're staring at <laughs> it, wanking at it. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, I watched that Sarah Everard thing mm. on BBC. Do you know? You know? No. You guys? I what? Watch TV, bro. I don't watch the rest. Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, but this is on net. This is on like this is on iPlayer, right? <clears throat> so, do you know who? I watch Match of the Day on iPlayer. <laughs> but do you know who Sarah Everard is? You're in the world. Uh, <laughs> maybe by faces, bro. Show Pull me. up a face well, she, for well, me. She, and I'll, um, yeah. She's she's rest in peace to her soul, but she's she's passed away now oh, right okay it's, do you you know her yeah? yeah yeah so um what happened to her was awful it was that <laughs> remembering covid where that police officer took that uh oh, girl off yeah, yeah, that's yeah. that's her right 
And uh, oh, so okay. I watched. Yes, now I know who you're talking about. I watched the case, and the guy was a police officer. Mm. I'm thinking um, because he took his phone, and they tracked his phone or his whereabouts when he was like, he t he took like a car, he rented a car, went to London, killed her, or took her back to like another place, right, a woods. <laughs> Do you know what you're talking about? You oh, wait, hold on. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, he took her to a woods <laughs> and they tracked his phone. But if it was a police officer, even he's making mistakes like that. Mm. Like you'd leave your phone. You don't yeah. need your phone when you're doing that. I'm not saying what he did, you know what I mean? He shouldn't be doing that anyway. Mm. He shouldn't be. He shouldn't. That would happen with me. I'd bring my phone. Mm. Yeah, you would. Yeah. yeah. You Bro, would. do you see that guy as well? That like they can actually track everything on your phone. There was a, another thing recently where this guy was, um, he was at an airport, right? And he was on the Wi-Fi, and he was just messaging his boys like, oh, I'm going to blow up this fucking plane, boys. As a joke, yeah, just like yeah. as you do as, with your mates, I suppose. <laughs> 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 and anyway, <laughs> somehow the airport read his messages through the Wi-Fi and the police rocked up and he got fucked for, for it. Fucking insane. They but might, that must have like, surprised me though. <clears throat> Does it not? You're not that, yeah, that doesn't surprise me that they've found a way, because obviously when you're connected to public Wi-Fi, especially mm. at an airport, yeah. like post everything that's been happening over the past like 10, 15 years, I'm not surprised they're like tracking shit or like getting your data. It's but that's got, like, seeing your yeah. messages. Yeah, that, yeah. that's thing. Exactly. In real crazy. time like that as well. Yeah, yeah. Gets and, yeah. Crazy, before but, yeah. the flight even happened, they got him. Yeah, but maybe they've got like buzzwords where like yeah, bomb. Yeah, so they would have mm, like, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah but what yeah, if yeah, you yeah. spelt it like bomb with a zero? Then you're probably cool. It's <laughs> a bit of advice for you. <laughs> 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 yeah, that would work. But yeah. also as well, I recently found out that, you know, Google Incognito. Yeah. That doesn't mean anything. Oh, they got fucked, didn't they? Yeah. They get sued. What? It doesn't, the, your data still yeah, out yeah, there. Google it doesn't got, mean anything. Oh, Google okay. got Fuck. sued by like the EU or, or the UN or something recently uh, because they found out that incognito, incognito means fuck all. Oh, mm. oh. So yeah, but it just doesn't save your search. It doesn't save it on your on your. Device. Just saves yeah. it on theirs. Yeah, on theirs, <laughs> literally. Yeah. And they sell that data so uh, they can see everything they? you've been watching, Carl. Oh, good. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah. Have you ever used incognito? I use it for yeah, porn yeah, always. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you, 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 you didn't fap for a while. Both we, that was both. Wait, you, so, wait, wait, how do you know this? We had they, this conversation. We, we had this Come on, relax, relax. It was like in the in the mix of it at the time. Or was I done? I can't remember. Uh, I think you might have been done at that point. Nah, yeah. I don't think so. Really? Was I, was I, I think, locked in? I think you were locked in. Because I, I think um, you were maybe like a week and a half in. I made it two weeks. I remember that. Yeah. Ooh, and I, and I, I think I said I made it a few days. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you do. Yeah. yeah. I started having wet dreams. I was like, yeah. this is pointless. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Bro, we posted a clip about that, though. And there were so many people in the comments like, this is bullshit. You need to wank. Mm. Like, do you? No, you don't need to. <laughs> you don't need to. Wank. You give your banging enough, then it's yeah. fine. Yeah. 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 Um. Yeah. Nah. It was rough. Wait. So you're not banging enough because you kept on having wet dreams. I had one wet dream. Ah. Oh. But in good? the two weeks that I didn't um wank, I also didn't bang. Mm. So why? Yeah. What on purpose? No, it wasn't even on. Uh, was it on purpose? I don't think it was on purpose. I think stars are just aligned. Stars aligned. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Purity. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. And then, yeah. Wet dream. I was like. Charged. I'm charging this whole yeah. stupid little... Do you like, remember your wet dream? No. Uh, Do you? <laughs> I remember one. Go on. I think I explained this to someone. Did you? When I was in it, I saw it. I was down an alleyway. Oh, God. And there was an Asian girl. Oh, that's so weird, Cole. That what happened? the fuck? You can't control your wet dream. <laughs> no, but that's still your brain <laughs> thinking that. And then it was... It was dark. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds awful. No, but I... No, no. Right, she got to me. Okay. <laughs> And then, <laughs> and, then, and then we were just having sex in the alleyway. What, you in your dream were doing it? Yeah. I've yeah, yeah, never yeah, had yeah, yeah. that. I thought that was had, impossible. I've had, well, I had or, or I was sex about to. in your dream. Yeah, because it's always like, I always get it where I'm like, just about to then I wake up. I, that must no, be, that must be a lot. lot. Yeah, but that's when you come yeah. though. What do you mean? I don't When you're having sex come. in the dream, I, I, that's when I came. I, uh, this was ages ago, by the way. <laughs> so you actually experienced it in your dream? It was, you know, it was, it was a great, it was a weird sensation. <laughs> so it's a, a great, great sensation. <laughs> no, you, you, could feel, you, you could feel it coming. <laughs> sorry. No, 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 no. Sorry. I'm assuming. You, do you remember the girl? Like, do you know the girl like, in real life? No, no, I don't know the girl. It's but a made up girl. She's a made up girl. I don't believe that though. Mm. Because well, you can't dream about people you've never met before. I've heard that. But that could be a myth. Who knows? Uh, could it? 
Let's I don't think it could. AI. Can. I don't know. I also don't know how you can say that with confidence. Yeah, I if have heard. Say with true, confidence, true, 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 true. I'm only saying what I've read. So I don't. It, I swear. I'm just trying to like. But it could be like a stranger you've seen. I suppose. Yeah, it could just be like a random. Yeah, random. I'm playing devil's advocate. Yeah, I um. Yeah, so it was an Asian girl, but I've never actually slept with an Asian girl. Oh wow. There, there you go. go. Well, you have now. So. I, I have now. So. I did want to talk about when we went to the Gymshark event. Yep. We uh, saw you, was it last week? Yeah, it was last, last, no, last Friday, week. Friday. A few days yeah. ago. A few days ago, pretty much, for the Nganu Joshua. But you guys left early. No. no we did you not? No, we, we didn't know. see you. We, we didn't... went to the back. We were standing. Bro, we were standing. Oh, man. Yeah, that was, was long. Oh. We stood up for like four bloody hours. Yeah. But yeah, then, yeah, yeah. see, we were complaining about it, right? We were like, oh, my God, my legs are hurting. We turned around and Alicia, is it Alicia Dixon? Dixon. Yeah. 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 She, was was just, she was also stood up. I was like, okay, we can't complain. Yeah. Fuck yeah, me. She stood next to Jamie. So. Yeah. Were you? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know he was there. Yeah, man. At the back with the rest of Is he nice? I haven't met him. We didn't, didn't interact. We didn't interact. It was the middle of the fight. Crack on. No, what do you no. think of the fight? I feel bad for Fast, Francis. Yeah. Mm, but he yeah. Flopped. Yeah. He, uh, yeah. He, yeah. He wasn't, when he first came out, I was thinking, oh shit. Because I, I thought Francis was going to win mm. before. I, before. I thought so too. Did you? What did yeah, you think? I didn't think he was going to win. You oh, didn't? You, nah, 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 no way. I, yeah, but, I thought he had a good chance, but like, I didn't think he was going to win. There's just no way. Okay. Why? Because this is a second boxing match yeah but he fought yeah. Tyson bloody fury didn't he and he like, did we had this conversation the other day yeah, did. but like it was one of them ones where he might have won but him and basically Ngannou's and Joshua Styles are very similar which is just like oh. hard punch like it's who's got the hardest punch mm. just stay like very very in the pocket so um Ngannou's also not used to moving back so Ngannou's fight with Tyson Tyson is like a bit likes to dance around a lot mm. so he's gone Ngannou's style is to move forward move forward move forward move forward and he was able to do that against Tyson, which benefited him a lot more. Mm. AJ is very much the same, which is just move forward, move forward, move forward. So AJ is just better at that than mm. Ngannou. And Ngannou yeah. doesn't move <clears throat> side to side at all. He can't, he hasn't learned it yet. So as oh. soon as I saw him, just like, he just does not fall him back. I was like, oh, he's going to fuck you up. Mm. I think I wanted him to win because he's got like quite a cool background story, the story's doesn't he? story's sick. Mm. I remember yeah. you talking yeah. to him. Yeah, 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 yeah. I love his story. story. Mm. Like, Explain his story. One of you. So he was, uh, he's from Cameroon mm. and he spent like literally like a year and a half. He basically was just like working in like the mines in Cameroon or whatever. And was just like, I want to be a boxer. So he just randomly decided one day, cool, I'm just going to like migrate to, he wanted to go to France. France. How'd he get there? Bro, yeah, that's the crazy. story. How yeah. the fuck did he It took him 18 months to get there. And then literally it was like, um, boat. Illegally. Oh, the, was it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got but, a boat and illegally or drove to like a different country in Africa, then got a boat to like Turkey or something. Mm. He was there for like a year. And basically in order to get through the border, there's like this fucking, what was it? Basically there's like border control, mm. but like insane where like um, wire, like mesh wire and everything like that. And mm. like barbed wire, sorry. And guards with guns and everything like that. And they just will just kill you mm. to try and cross the border. Where was this? Uh, this was either in, where was it? I want to say like Turkey or Morocco. Oh yeah, they'll fuck you up. Yeah, 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 mm. yeah. And basically oh. he tried like three times to like get through. And what they would do is there, I think it was Morocco because what they would do, if he got caught, they would put him on a van, drive him into the middle of the Sahara, drop him there. Whoa. And then he would have to walk for days with no food or water fuck. back into Morocco. And then we go again. And they did they do that? Did yeah, they do so that he, to him? Yeah, yeah. They, they did it to him three times. And he, he walked. He just kept going back mm. and then trying again. Oh, man. And mate. then oh. on, the, on the third or fourth time, he finally made it through. How? how? Yeah. How? Um, he just like snuck through. They didn't see him. And it was like, because they would all, basically they would all, all of like the refugees and stuff would organize together. And it would mm. be like, they'd have a contact and it'd be like once a month, they'd get all their funds together. And they'd be like, cool. We're going to buy like a, a boat or whatever. And it'll be like a little dinghy. And mm. it would be like, cool, we're going to make the escape like this day. So all of you come, we're all going to hide in a bush and then they can wait in the bush for like two days, whatever, to wait for this like change of shifts or whatever. And they'll be like, cool, this is the time we're going to make. All of you, like they all get given like mobile phones. They all get given like a little bit of food. They all get given a little bit of water. And it's like, whoever makes it, meet me on the other side and then we'll go off to France. So <laughs> he's an illegal immigrant. Yeah. And then they just accepted him. Um, yeah, so I think when he was in France, in order for him to, the reason he couldn't box was because he was an illegal immigrant mm. and it was going to be too difficult to get him like a boxing license and stuff like that. So while he was training to be a boxer in France, 
one of his coaches was like, um, he was homeless in France, obviously. Mm. So one of his boxers was like, if you want some money now, like they're doing this like MMA stuff. Um, oh yeah, because he did MMA. Yeah, 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 you should do MMA. Okay, yeah. Um, and he was like, fine. Like while I'm training, I might as well make some money doing MMA. And he just won and won again and won again and won again. God. And he gets signed to the UFC. Yeah. And won again, won again, won again. And then he was the champion of the UFC. That's so crazy. That's ridiculous. That's, yeah. that's the coolest story ever. And then he moved over to the boxing and fought Fison. Fison Tori. <laughs> <Just Fison Tourist. laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. and they were saying like, on the other day, they were saying like the purse he got for his last UFC fight was like 600K. Mm. And the money he got from the AJ fight was like 20 mil. Bro, imagine 20, 20 mil. Million. Oh yeah, I saw it. It was like 50K a punch they earned. Oh my God. <laughs> every, every punch they got 50K. <laughs> But yeah, imagine well, that wow. from coming from that background. Yeah. Mm. That's, that's an insane. In, in a short amount of time as well. How, like, how, when did he go through all that? Or oh, it was a, a few years. Like, I think, I want to say the whole thing was over the span of like three or four years. That's not even a lot. So just COVID. Pretty in COVID, much, he was like yeah. jumping into France. And, and he just decided I'm going to be a boxer. And yeah, he went through all of this just because he was like, mate, mine's a shit. I want to be a boxer. <laughs> <laughs> that was his sole motivation yeah. to go through all of that. That's crazy. Yeah, but you would, uh, to be fair though, like if you're in that situation in the mines, I feel you're probably going to just like run away and- Well, yeah, yeah. but then becoming a, a champion in the UFC is pretty- He's a wham guy though. He's I don't think just being wham- I don't Well, think enough, actually yeah. it's definitely not enough. Do you know why, Carl? Go on. Did you see there was a punching bag at the Gymshark event? Yeah. Did, you Did you guys use it? Use it? Uh, yeah, yeah. All right. Okay, well, what, what, what was your scores? We Bro, dabbled a little. Um, 800 about something. 800 and something. Yeah. What know, was I this? was fucking pissed off. Go on. Because I tried to play it sexy and cool, right? Like mm. I couldn't be bothered. Mm. And then, so you saw the first one I did. Yeah. Was like, so, because everyone was like pressure. I was like, go, 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 go. And mm. I was like, I physically can't be bothered because mm. I'm really competitive. Mm. Yeah, I like, yeah, I am. You went first and I was like, I can't be bothered to go for blows because mm. we'll just be here all night, all night yeah, and yeah, I'm yeah. gonna break my wrist or something <laughs> yeah. like trying mm. to beat you. So I did this like really slow one and then I got like 450 or whatever. Oh, you're oh, embarrassing. Was, like, no, but it was like on purpose. Sure, it was, like, okay. Yeah, okay, cool. yeah, yeah, But yeah, then yeah, yeah. the second one, I tried a little bit, innit? Mm. But I missed it oh, and hit like oh, it my pinky, yeah. and ah. I got like three hundred. But <laughs> oh, the, way, the speed at which I hit it, you'd think that was the hardest I could possibly get. Oh. And it hit like three hundred. I was like, fuck. Oh. oh no! Also, the floor was wet, so you couldn't really pivot your foot. Oh, was, was it? Was it? Oh, I mean, when we did it, when we did it, all the sweat from you fucking attacks. Was it? <laughs> There's Bro, a guy that tried intense. to punch, and he actually snipped. This when we were playing foosball or when we were playing. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy that slips, I was thinking, damn, thank God that wasn't me. Yeah. Mm. So you got 800 and something. Yeah. Okay, Jack. All right, we've got clips here. We got who, who do you think did the best out of me and Jack? Who do you think has got the dog in I reckon in him? technique wise, Cole was better. But Cole, Jack, technique, Jack's power. Jack's got height and power, bro. So. Mm. Well, yeah, height plays a massive, well, we'll massive, see. Let's massive have a look. Part. By the way, so let, let me give a bit of backstory here. This was our first punch. It was, yeah. So... Yeah. So we weren't uh, used to it as well. Uh, we'll tell you our best scores after, but this yeah. this is our first punch. So this okay. is Cole here. Cole, your jawline looks incredible there. It does, doesn't it? Well played. <laughs> it don't usually like that. <laughs> oh, that's fucking sick. Well played. Yeah. So what but was no, that? Seven, uh, seven, seven, eight, eighty. 80. Seven yeah. eighty. Nice. There's Cole's there. I don't think this was your first punch, Jack. This one it was coming up. Um, no, let's see. We'll see, won't we? Jesus. The thing is, he swings low. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, bro. That was right. a good punch. There we that go. Was a, that was a good <laughs> punch. <laughs> I feel Very good though. Punch. Very good punch. It, no, look, it's harder for me because mm. no, being taller, yeah, the, the ball is like here. He can literally, he swung his arm right back, smashed the shit out of it. I had to like punch up. You feel me, homie? Speaks of my time, homies. Bro. Yeah. yeah, I was going to say. Yeah, but he's taller than me. Is he? I was 5'10. Oh, okay. Or five, no, he? he's 5'11, yeah. Mm. Look ah. it up. What do you think please about look the... up Mike Tyson's height now, please, Matthew. <laughs> what do you think about the Tyson, Jake Paul? Thing? Crazy. Oh, ridiculous. How is that happening? He's, he's like 50 something now. 50 57, yeah. But, but 57? 57. What's he doing? Feet, but the thing is, have you 1.78 meters? What the fuck? No, that can't be six, near six nah. foot. Right, How about seven, eight, yeah, but seven, maybe seven, that's seven, his um five eight bro five no 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 yeah no that's his current one so doing prime because he's sh he's shrunk now. How the, what's the people shrink. Trust oh. me, people shrink with age. 
<laughs> You've already height started with that. <laughs> People shrink with the height they're using here is probably as primary. 5'10". There you go, see? Uh, okay. I, right. It still says 178. That's weird. Yeah, mm. it's weird. All right, never mind. Right. Well, anyway, yeah. So Jake Paul and Mike Tyson. Have you seen the podcast he's been doing and shit? Yeah, hot, hot box, hot boxing, hot box. Yeah, I'm not seeing, but I know of it. He's a different person now. Like it's weird. I, I, Mike, Mike. Yeah, I've I've watched a lot of his ep. Pretty much every episode I've watched, he's burst into tears. Seriously, <laughs> genuinely, he loves crying. He though. cries all the time. He's like, I, I just love life. Oh, that's a terrible. <laughs> yeah, no, you sound like Sid the <laughs> Slop. You yeah. actually do. Sound I like love life. <laughs> Lash melon. Oh. No, strange. but he, yeah, he just he cries all the time about how beautiful life is, and like he's very pe. He's like so. Basically, he talks about he he was a very angry man, as we know. Yeah, he yeah. very uh, emotionally damaged man. Very he says insecure man. Like he wanted to be the best, but he was very troubled you know um but he said he tried dmt uh mm. and the first time he tried it he said his ego got taken out of him and he became a different man he met he met a frog or some shit Fair. the toad he met a toad okay and uh <laughs> you can watch him talk about it and he said this toad relieved him from all that negative <laughs> shit and now he's like he like he's a meditator and all that. I've heard some pretty nutty DMT stories. Yeah. There. Well, I uh, I spoke to someone yesterday, mm. and he. I thought you were going to say you tried DMT. Yeah. I'm so well, intrigued. For well, a no. Same. Well, no. He. I said. He said. Oh, have you done DMT? I'm like, nah, that'd be sick. What does DMT even stand for? I don't know what it is. Dimethyltryptamine. I was well played. Jeez, yeah, I, I I was about to say that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Got to say it now. Dimethyltryptamine. Okay, yeah, fair enough. You just probably... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I was waiting for you to stumble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah, so uh, what are you saying? So uh, he, you he, said, uh, he yeah. said, oh yeah, I do DMT sometimes. It's great. And I said, wow, can you can you get What's me it? some, please? Mm. And he was like, yeah, yeah, sure. We, we know him, you know him. Do I? Yeah, 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 I won't say his name. Okay. Um, you probably guys know him. And uh, he said, uh, yeah, he'll get me some. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. Be careful, bro. My, my, one of my best mates did it. So I was, I don't know whether I've talked about this before, but I was meant to go to a house party at his right, and uh, I was. So he, he was living in um, Southampton at the time, which is about two and a half hours from me, right? And I, I was on my way. I was about an hour and a half into the drive, and he calls me up and he goes, Jack, don't come. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you spoke about this the did last I, time we were on Did I show. tell you this? <laughs> it's so, it's so well, anyway, so so I was like, what? I, I've been traveling an hour yeah. and a half. Bro, I've I've canceled all my plans to come to this house party. Yeah. And he's like, it's not happening anymore. <laughs> oh. And I was like, bro, is something, what the fuck's wrong with you? And he said, uh, I've, I've smoked some weed. Bye. And I was like, Shit. he smokes weed every fucking day. I was like, yeah, you, yeah. what yeah, the fuck is can't going be on? The effect, yeah. yeah. Anyway, so he later on, so I was like, what, what the fuck? I just went home. And later I was like, what was that all about? I was mad. And he said he tried DMT and uh, he was apparently on his bed. And it felt like he was like in space and shit. He was completely gone. Really? Like yeah, completely. So safe space. Yeah, but yeah, apparently yeah. it only lasts like eight minutes. Yeah, I've heard it's quick. It's Unless only, you yeah. do ayahuasca. Ayahuasca is supposed to fuck you up for like a day. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. yeah. But, ayahuasca is something fat. No, I ain't doing that. But you go to a tribe, don't you? Yeah, they, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. They yeah. make it. Offense, yeah. Yeah, you what? have to have like a proper like instructor there to like monitor you. Yeah. And, like, Did I inject it? No, no. You drink it. It's you drink it. Mm. But the thing is, so that that DMT is different from the what that one. Because mm. you, DMT, you can have like the one made in a lab, which no, you smoke, oh. uh, but obviously it's more dangerous. But the real, the real stuff, I'm pretty sure, I might have this wrong, but I'm pretty sure DMT is the spit of a, a toad that's like a hallucinogenic toad and they dry it in the sun and scrape it off the glass and that's DMT. Oh, right. But in ayahuasca, they put these branches in it, which stop your body from... Because when you have DMT, your body rejects it, obviously, and it fights it. But they put this branch in it, which stops that happening. So it just lasts hours. Jeez. Yeah, I've heard some Would you bad do stories from Iowa? Yeah, what, what have you heard? Just like about people, be, like um, if the balance is off and stuff, mm. the guy or girl, whoever that's running the little like mm. whatever the fuck you want, to say, <laughs> the little sesh. Uh, <laughs> they mix up like the ratio. It can like fuck you. So like you mm. can be tripping and you could be like violently sick. Yeah. at the same oh, no, time and you have no. no idea what is going on mm. oh, and all it scary. is is just like a mess of just hallucinations and vomit and hallucinations oh. and vomit but you're complete you don't have any control either yeah, yeah, yeah you're completely out of your body 
Oh, which is great out. and uh have you ever seen the dmt sim can you try to get this up actually dmt simulations i watched one because apparently oh yeah I yeah i've seen one so the way the way dmt works and everyone has like the same experience right you start the trip by seeing your worst nightmares everything oh. and because your brain's doing it you can't hide from it because you know what your worst nightmares mm. are and uh you experience all of it in the start and then once you're like shriveled down, you're scared as shit. Apparently you like rock it off and it, you hear all this shit and then you get through the other side and you see all these like frogs and shit. So I don't you, well, want to do that. You don't want to nah, do it? I'm not going to lie. No, no, that's, I really that's a don't. trip. That I don't want to really take. Scary. Okay, would you do it though if someone guaranteed you'd be like 10% better in yourself? I'd have to see a before and after of someone else. Can you please do DMT bad trip experience? Bro, it's scary as shit. So you wouldn't do it? Nah, I have a real bad, like, yeah, this is probably more reason for me to do it, but I have a real bad, like, control thing. So, like, anything of, like, cool, it's your brain that's doing it to you. Mm. So there's no escape. Just sounds like hell to me. Yeah. Yeah, nah. Mm. Yeah, but you just got to roll with the punches, bro. I what does that mean? said I have a control. <laughs> 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 but I do think about that, right? You know when you have these like mythical stories of people seeing like a fucking horse man and all that shit? I reckon back in the days, they used to just like, they'd get licked by a frog and that's why they'd see it. Maybe. Maybe, bro. Maybe. <clears throat> Fuck knows. But Maybe. Going, going back to that Mike Tyson thing, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, I think it will ruin his legacy mm, a little yeah. bit because he's known, you see him back in the day, like your parents will know he's bashing people's brains in mm. and, uh, and now he's gonna be fighting some YouTuber mm. and he, he, he can lose. If he loses, people are gonna be like, this pathetic yeah. old man on the floor. Yeah, true. I, I, I'm, I'm think these days, I think not many people care about legacy anymore. You, no. Well, the thing is, have you seen how much they're getting? That's what I say. When no. there's like yeah, someone's offering true. you like fifty mil. More than that. How much they get? Is it? So they I think the they're saying the the thing will produce like three to three fifty million. Oh. And how much are they getting? It'll probably be getting like getting eighty mil, probably. Netflix, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I don't even get how that works. Like, it's you don't get pay per view. You just get you can watch it if you're a subscriber. Maybe Netflix up the, the Netflix will be paying them, won't they? Yeah, but like, how are they I mean, getting? I don't know money? how they're generating the income, but yeah, it's um, yeah, it's. What do you think of it then? Do you think you should do it? I don't think you should do I it. Think I don't think it should, should it, be a thing. But since they're doing it, I guess money. they're doing it. I don't know what the rule system is because I know last time uh, Mike Tyson fought uh, Roy Jones Jr. And they had some like gentlemen's agreement mm. where they're like, there's no mm. like real hard punches to the head or anything like that. It's oh. like a, a little bitch fight, basically. Yeah. I, I don't know if this has similar rules. I saw like a troll in TikTok that someone said that Jake's going to wear like a. Uh, like oh, I a, saw that. Yeah. Head, yeah. Yeah. Head guard and shit like that. But Surely I have no not. idea. But from what I've seen, like, I'm more concerned that, yeah, Jake <clears throat> really doesn't hold back at all. Mm. Yeah. What's it, uh, it's going to generate $300 million. Yeah. Jesus. Jesus. It's a lot, isn't it? Yeah. So I Fair mean, play to him, man. If yeah. someone offered you 150 mil to like sack off your legacy, would you do it? Fuck yes. Exactly. I mean, uh, Floyd, it depends what the legacy is. If it was Mike Tyson, he's if, the if bad you were Mike the... Tyson at 57 now, it depends how much money he's got. He must have quite a bit. Well, he's got he, loads. Yeah, yeah, he's got loads. Well, no, but he did after his boxing career, he went completely bankrupt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Like completely. Well, and, and during it, I think. But, yeah, he just bought like tigers and pigeons yeah. and shit. <laughs> Yeah. Pigeons make you go bankrupt, do they? You, buy, no. you can pick a pigeon off the street for free. No, no, these are trained pigeons. <laughs> oh, Genuinely. do you know that story about Mike? You might know it, so I don't what? say it. I don't know. About the pigeons? No. You don't know? Right. Ah, oh, this is sick. Was it? <laughs> no, this is sick. Right, so the reason he got into boxing, right, is because when he was a kid, he had these pet pigeons, okay? Mm. Um, and then he, uh, he was, he was a friend was around or something, or he was out with these pigeons. <laughs> <laughs> he was out with these pigeons, yeah. And then someone took his pigeon and bit his head off. Yeah. Was it Ozzy Osbourne? <laughs> <laughs> bit his head off. So he wanted to beat him up. So he went boxing and started training because he loved pigeons. Mm. You know, he's in that pic picture with him with a pigeon. He does love pigeons. He loves I'm pigeons. I'm sure you're making this entire story up. <laughs> <laughs> Look up Mike Tyson pigeon, please. No, he does love pigeons. Yeah, I'm that's sure true. he does, but that story doesn't Trust make sense at all. It, it, it I'm does. sure that is not the truth. Unless, unless he bit the, the head off or something. Why would he bite Type the head in, off um, his own pigeon? What happened with Mike Tyson, the pigeon there? There we go. Down. If you look down, that top one. Nope, got scroll up. 
Use your eyes. It's this uh, <laughs> down. People ask. Up. People also ask. That's yeah. it. There you go. He's around there. Pigeon into which I was supposedly bullied. I the bike. One of his pet pigeons. He fought the bully back. See. Um, but did he? The I don't think bit he about him biting him. a pigeon's head off is the bit yeah. I'm getting a bit confused. <clears throat> with. No, it is. It must be there. I it overcame his years of Read it. Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Um, did you know he used to get hypnotized? Did he? Yeah, his trainer. Um, what Gus uh, Demato? Gus Demato. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I used to hypnotize him. Really? Um, and be like, that's why he was saying he's gone on. Um, the first time he was on Joe Rogan, it was a dark episode. Mm. Like, and he was talking about like. Um, how he used to get hypnotized and it would always be like, you're a warrior, you're a killer. Like no one can ever stop you. You're this, you're that. But <clears throat> they never trained him how to like turn that off. So they didn't train oh, wow. him to like learn how to switch in and out of those mindsets. Mm. So he would be in that mindset 24 hours a day. That's mad. And then he said that he got into a, a series where like he would get sexual gratification from violence. Oh my oh, God. So he was yeah. coming. Oh, when bro. He was, beating he was like up. talking to, and he was saying, like, this is the first time we went to Joe Rogan. He was talking about, like, how all of that's in the past and all this kind of stuff. And, like, he didn't put on any gloves for, like, years and didn't teach any of his kids how to box or anything like that. Mm. And then when he was training for the, I think it was for the Roy Jones fight, mm. he started training again. He was like, oh, I'm getting it back. Like, and he, you could tell he was being so sincere that he that's... didn't understand that no one else gets turned on from violence. So the way he was talking, Jeffrey Dahmer does. Yeah, I was about to say that. Yeah, Darman, he loves yeah. that yeah. shit. Um, but he, the way he was talking to Joe, was just like, "Oh yeah, now I'm getting that feeling back," and just like, when I'm doing this and I'm doing that and I'm training and I'm imagining, him, I'm imagining fighting him, I'm imagining like breaking his jaw and I'm getting hard. And I'm like, oh, like, he's getting hard. Yeah, he's getting hard. And Joe's just there like, oh, what's yeah. going and you can on? tell oh. he has no idea. This is a no, not a normal way to think. Bro, oh, imagine so fighting that guy in his Ew. prime. He's, he's punching your head in and getting a fucking hard on. <laughs> <laughs> terrifying. As yeah, well, yeah. scary, mm. scary podcast episode. Ah, so would you um, would you fight him for 50 mil? And in terms of like... like yeah. You, no. For 50 mil? Fight anyone for 50 mil. In his prime? No. No, that's... No, 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 no that's, that's a death wish. That's a different I mean, story. you just get knocked out once. Do you not think it's still a death wish now? Do you not think he's punching Yeah, I still think... He's still a serious guy now, but... He's still serious, but... He have you seen him? Re he's like walking around with a walking stick. Yeah, and shit. really. Yeah, yeah. I saw that. Oh dear. Like, I saw don't that. get me wrong. He's scared. He'd still batter my head in. But like compared to him in his prime, like him when he was what nineteen was scary, oh, bro. Man, Even his scary. eyes just look like he. Yeah, yeah he doesn't care. There's when no. He was fourteen. He was like fifteen stone or something. And he yeah, was like stacked. He was like fighting like 22, 23 year olds. Mm, really? No one like no one believed he was fourteen. Mm. That hypnosis stuff is interesting. Have you have, do you believe in all that like hypnosis? I've never nah. tried it. You so never tried yeah. it? Because we wanted to get a hypnotist on the episode because I don't know how 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 could that work? Well oh, well you don't know my story about I've spoken to you about Darren Brown's oh, yeah. story. I got hypnotized with Darren Brown. That's embarrassing. <laughs> no, it's not embarrassing. <laughs> no, it's not embarrassing. Yeah, got, did he actually get you? He got me. <laughs> he got he got me the bastard. Yeah, no, because I wanted to. Because I was I was I didn't believe it like okay. you guys. I was like like it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. I was listening to the words he was saying, and then this thing happened where he went like that, or whatever. And I and then the lights went off and they came back on straight away. And then he replayed the footage that he was filming. Some people got hypnotized. Some people didn't. He replayed the footage. And uh, there was like a whole 15, 20 seconds that went past and he was doing all this random shit on stage. I didn't see any of it. It was, mm. we just went black. It's Men weird, that. That's, that's weird. That's concerning. That is weird. That is weird. I've heard Darren Brown talk about like the, hyp the hypnosis stuff and he was, no offense, he said it is about like susceptibility. Yeah, yeah. And like um, he said, one you of the reasons is like not even yeah. necessary that you have to believe it is that you have to be, again, no offense, the kind of person who like does what they're told. Mm. And like he was saying, does what they're told. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I don't. Yeah, he was saying that like one of the reasons you know when he does a lot of it, he'll smack people on the back of the neck. Yeah, yeah. He says one of the reasons that you do that is because it shocks them so much that when he tells you sit down, like immediately, especially he said heightening, bringing people on stage heightens that susceptibility and agreeableness. So he said another reason. So he'll get them on stage, which already people you're already going to be in the mode mode of like okay, like whatever, just tell me like, tell me what to do. And I'm like mm. super uncomfortable, super scared. Like you've got, you're not getting on stage with any ego and then he'll smack you on the back of the neck when you're not ready. And it puts you in that state of like, what the fuck? <laughs> so when he tells you go to sleep, you went, just go. <laughs> yeah, that's really? How can someone just do that though? How do you learn this? We just yeah, go around the street, you're smacking Imagine. people up. That's yeah, bad. I do believe in like, 
you know like how corp corporations hypnotize you I, this was on Darren brown as well back in the day in like cinemas and advertisement and stuff they'd so you know how like when you're watching a movie uh it's like loads of images yeah. flashing like hundreds mm -hmm. of thousands of times in the movies they'd make like yeah. single frames where it'd be like uh popcorn oh right yeah yeah yeah. and apparently in your you don't pick up on it consciously but subconsciously it makes you want popcorn yeah and they they ban doing it mm. trust yeah, me that's the thing uh, mm. what do they call that again um, oh is it subliminal something subliminal message oh yeah yeah, 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 yeah. yeah yeah it's kind of like when um you've got a song in your head like you can hear someone you could probably like hear someone singing a song like down the street and then like three hours later, you'll you're be like, I'm in, yeah. yeah. I'm singing a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you're right. We did that in LA. Like I was, um, I was in Miami the other day. Mm. I was um, humming a song and my mate was like, oh, um, what song are you thinking about right now? And I told oh, him oh, yeah. and he was like, I've been thinking about that song literally since I woke up this morning. Mm. And I was like, that's fucking weird. We hadn't heard the song. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that's... Random like Fleetwood Mac song or something. Well, do you ever get it? Well, I get this all the time. You probably get it as well. It's not that, it's all right. But I'm in the car. <clears throat> I'm, I'm, there's a song that's playing and I'll cut the song off, right? Because maybe I'll get a call and then the song stops and I'll be, I wouldn't notice. And then I'll be driving for another 10 minutes and then I'll start singing the song and I'll start singing it and I'll start singing the chorus and I'll be like, oh yeah, yeah. And I'll turn the thing up and it'd be exactly the same time on, on the a song. different song. No, 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 no on the same song. song. Oh, I turn the volume up. 10 minutes later. Yeah, yeah. And I'm singing the chorus. And it's because that's when it stopped when I turned it down. So I turn it on and I'm singing the exact same part of the chorus. Oh, wow. That's, Do you not get I've that? I've never had that. I've never had that no. in my life. That's mental. I've I get that, that, that quite a lot. Uh, never. Weird. Maybe just like psychic or some Super shit. weird. Um, um, well, I did want to talk about, since we're on the boxing topic, yeah. Ryan Garcia. Wait, what? On there, it says, Butler in the buff. Who was better out of Jack and Cole? Who would be the best stripper? Who the oh, fuck's written this? Well, Matt. Matt put this. I asked the same question where I saw. He this. has done his research. Yeah. We're, okay. Yeah. We'll talk about this, and then we'll go back to my <laughs> thing. Because okay. I didn't. I didn't know. You don't. Do you not know this? No. I found out ten minutes before you guys got here. Yeah. So uh, we've got on our little notes thing here. Butter in the buff days. No butler. Butler. Oh yeah. Butler. <laughs> we got but <laughs> rubbing themselves up with butter. butter. Buff. <laughs> Yo. All right, uh, it says Butler in the Buff days, and our producers written this, and I said, "What? What the fuck is that?" And uh, it says he was better out of Jack and Cole, who would be a better stripper. And I'm like, "What is going on?" Yeah. And he said, "Apparently, you two used to be." But yeah, in the buffers. Yeah, what the yeah, hell? Let's get you naked for money. What did that you do? Uni, bro. We were broke. Yeah. So. 18, 19 years old. Together? Yeah. Yeah, did it. Naked. Um, well, we had like a little apron thing here. But naked under it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Whoa. Dick out, yeah. ass out. Yeah, yeah. So this is real creepy. So basically what happened, right? It is. You know when like you're just together with a friend mm. and you're like, ah, oh, like poor, poor, poor. And mm. I don't think <laughs> I do not think, oh, should we just strip now? <laughs> oh, get naked, boys. Okay, so it's similar to like, oh, how much would you like Buying a seven-year-old woman for that's how it's Seven. Seventy. You? Seventy. Right? <laughs> Did you say seven for free? No, go on. Free. Yeah. So seventy-year-old, not seventy-year-old. Seven. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my right. god. Seventy-year-old woman. Yeah. That's how it starts, and you're mm. like, oh, I don't know. Like, so someone will say something stupid, like, oh, a million. And mm. you're like, come Shoot. on, don't be stupid. Ten grand. Let's get it. And then yeah, would yeah, get yeah. it ordered. And then yeah. eventually, when you realize how often you're eating like tuna pasta, yeah. it mm. gets down to literally like 50 quid. Right. Then, yeah, okay, yeah, it would. We got in like, it wasn't even with you, it was with um, Rem. Rem and yeah. one of our other mates. We were talking, talking, talking. And then we got into that story. And I was like, bro, to be fair, like being a male escort doesn't sound that bad. Mm. And then we got, it was, we got into this tangent about it one evening, just about like, I wonder how much you would make if you were just like a male escort. And all you had to do was just like, and that's when, you know, when they used to sell, tell stories about like, oh, escorts don't actually have to sleep with the person. They can just mm. have to take them out. Mm. And I'm like, oh, I'd go out with like old women like three times a week if it meant like I was going to get loads of money. Ooh. So we looked into Whoa. it. And then as we we're looking into it, it's like, is this actually a real thing? We looked into it, looked into it. And then Butlers in the Buff came up mm. on uh, Google and it was like, oh, all you need to do is like, have a good body or whatever, like be chatty. Oh, uh, you're out. Like then. cancer. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. And this is when I was Bang the gym back then. <laughs> oh, is it? Yeah. yeah. Well, I used to do like um, a lot of bodybuilding competitions and shit. What the fuck? Have you got pictures? Uh, yeah. Um, but oh. not not for today. 
<laughs> <laughs> so yeah, so that back then, or like, I was like, yeah, cool. And they were paying like uh, 50 quid 50 an, hour. an hour. 50 quid an yeah. hour. And what, what do you have to do? So you basically, rock parties, you rock up really? to like Hindus. Mm. No way. Yeah, they'd basically email, the guy nice. would email you and be like, this is your job. It could be anywhere in the country. Yeah. Um, so you'd you pay for your own petrol and they'd reimburse yeah, yeah. you in it. Yeah. Mm. And then you'd get there literally with like in your normal clothes and like, cool, here for the hen party. And a lot of time it'd be like one of those like mansions in the middle of nowhere. Mm, nice. oh, and you'd pull up shit. and there'd just be like 20 fucking drunk women there. No. At <clears throat> hen do. The and then you'd get there, get changed. Joking. Like, <laughs> you literally like apron comes like halfway down your thighs. Your dick's out under there. Is you hard? Do you show him your knob? No, no, are you hard? Never. No, no, no. Nah, I'm not no. hard, bro. I'm terrified. But as like, this is eight, when like yeah, 18, 18, 19. 19. Yeah, but oh. surely you'd get a bit, a bit hard. I went to one. Oh, I went to yeah, one. Yeah, I told yeah, you about yeah, this one. I went to one where the hen and a like a maid of honor were like, yeah. "Oh, have you ever been hard before?" I was like, "Obviously not." She was like, "Today will be the day you get hard." And they spent the. I was there for three hours. They spent the entire three hours trying to get me hard. A hen. So, so, so the wife. The wife, the wife to be. Oh. Bitch. Yeah. The wife to be. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It was insane. So did they get you hard? Like a semi at one point. <laughs> what were they doing to try? What were they doing? Yeah, I'd like, like to lap know. dancers and shit. Naked. The wife was giving you a. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never given my oh. girlfriend a butler in the buff. That's never. the same. Do it, why would they? Yeah. Why would? And the amount of times they would offer like for you to stay. Mm. Every to suck you off. Mm. Yeah. Oh, one one girl offered to suck me off. Uh, you said no. Another hen. I said no. Yeah. Why? A hen. No, she wasn't a hen. She was just like a guest at the hen. Wait, wait, wait. The power play, bro. It's not. When we it's were not doing what you're dreaming it, about, yeah, it's bro. Not, I promise bro. you, oh. you feel when, yeah. like I don't know how to explain it. It's not it. the like, mentality we have now. Mm. Okay. Yeah, do you know like, what I'm saying? We're growing as fuck now. Mm. Like you really do feel like a little kid in that moment. Yeah, because yeah. mm. you're on your own. Like it's not banterous. There's literally just like oh. 20 women who also like well, like twice our age. A lot yeah. of the time would be like mm. 40, 30, 40, and like I'm 19, 18, mm. and they're just like, "Yeah, do you want a blowjob?" And you're just like, uh, uh, "That is uh, mad." Like, I would say mad yes. intimidating. <laughs> is that it's intimidating, bro. It's mad intimidating. Obviously, every single time I left, I was like, yeah. "Fuck, why did I get this exactly. blowjob?" Mm. But um, do you do you have to speak to them, or you just dance? Yeah, about? yeah, no, what do you no. Say? Speak, have to serve them, in, serve them, champagne, champagne shit like that. Do you have to like serve. make them make them wet? Nope. No. Wait, no, so no. Fu, you, yeah. you, did, you never received a blowjob either from no. them. You never fucked any of them? No. Nope. Okay. Um, why? <laughs> Again, same thing. One, nerves, bro. When nerves you're like one. 18, 19, two, the hierarchy of it is just so off. Like you're, hmm. you're there to work and obviously they're there to have fun with you in that way, but it just doesn't happen. A lot of shit goes through your mind as yeah, well. Yeah, like, bro. It's always like, there'll be one of them that's trying to fart. And then like, there's also 19 other like the, the, women there that aren't there for that. Yeah. So you're also mm. there, that obviously the company would always, always be like, do not fuck these girls. Mm. Like, oh. I promise you. Oh, really? Like, it's not just a case of you'll be sacked. Like they can, legal like, action. Legal, they can take yeah. legal action, all this kind of shit. Like, mm. do not fuck these girls. And you're like, all right, cool. Oh. So they'd scare you it's from a, the jump. Yeah, you're impressionable oh. at that point. Yeah, yeah. And then obviously there's is a case of just like, it's never a case of like, there's two of them there. And then like, they're both like, bang on it. It's always like 20 of them there. Oh. One of them is trying to oh, okay, okay. And then the others are just like getting on with their day. And it's like, ah, mm. oh, nah, this is- It's awkward. Oh, yeah, you, do you have shit. to do it on your own? There could be like group ones. Or oh, really? Did you have together? Did you done? We used to scam two, it and do a couple yeah. together. Yeah, we never got, we never, I don't think, do we ever get- We got booked together once. And that was the first one we yeah, ever yeah, we did. Did you like it? Was it good? It was cool. It was cool. We did We did that one trousers. Trousers, if you get a trouser job, you're buzzing. You were wearing trousers this time. Yeah, the first Yeah, so sometimes you get like corporate jobs or whatever. Um, and you'll be wearing trousers and those ones were sick. Just topless. Yeah. Why, why are they so much better? Because those were just like more responsible. Rel responsible and relaxed. And relaxed and chill yeah. and like your dick is not out. I feel that anyone who orders a butler and a buff is not responsible mm. or corporate in any way. You'd be surprised. Yeah, so bro, really? I think one did, job I did was like the fucking Slimming World World Championships or something. What? And it was like in Birmingham at one arena in Birmingham. And it was just like the award ceremony for like everyone who'd lost the most mm. weight on Slimming World. Oh, yeah. And I would just Taking stand- on stage, yeah. yeah I, I remember. Stage. So when they're getting the award, I would just like hold their hand while they get on Rub stage. That's so awkward. <laughs> yeah. What if they don't like vibe with what you're doing? I'd hate that. Like if you turn up and they're like, oh. There is a couple <laughs> that you turn up and a couple of them are just like, what the fuck is this? Yeah. Mm. Um, which is a bit awkward. But... And I, I did one in a um, in a very, very cold hall before. Oh. I think that was my, that was the one I got sacked That's from. That's when I quit. Yeah. You got yeah, sacked you got from it? Sacked yeah, for having yeah, such yeah, a small yeah. willy. <laughs> 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 it could be a factor. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't partaking in any of the activities, but I was so cold. Oh, really? Was, oh, really? I, well. yes. I quit. So cold. My yeah, last well. one was I quit. I went to, that was fucking Birmingham as well. Some Hindu had, there was like three of them. 
they'd rented out an entire club in Birmingham mm. and um, the club had kept, it was middle of December, the club had kept the aircon on as if it was like a normal club night. Oh. And I'm, it was a massive club mm. for three women that were sat at like one booth. That's crazy. The rest of the club was completely empty. It was the most awkward fucking The place. whole hen party was three women. Three yeah, women no mates. sat in a booth in the corner of this <laughs> massive club in Birmingham and it was like minus two in there. It was freezing. Oh. And I'm like naked. So every two minutes I'd run into the bathroom and put like the hand dryer on. And just oh. sit under the oh. hand dryer. Oh, I thought you meant on your cock. <laughs> no, bro, I, no point. No point. No, yeah, but did no, it, point. no one's ever seen it. No. Um, for me anyway. They must really? have looked. They must have pulled yeah. out. Uh, no, I don't no. think so. No. Did you shave just in case? Of course. Always. Yeah, yeah, always. Always. You Did you know. wash in case it smelt? Yeah, I mean, you yeah. wash. You wash anyway. Shower, you wash. Like, I suppose. Yeah, 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 I suppose. Yeah. If you're in a rush, you might. Who, who would make the better stripper out of me and Jack? Oh, well, it's obviously you in it. Well, no, no. Let why? Me, well, well, why? Well, got, like, why is it obviously him? Yeah, yeah he's what? got like abs and pecs. Yeah, but and that's shit. not. No, that's the not. Better awful. stripper. Yeah, 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 the better yeah. What does that mean? You can well, like, be a like, better, better dancer than that. Dancer, stalker. Exactly, bro. Okay, right. Who then? If you say cola after that <laughs> fucking yeah, story, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. Who, does <laughs> yeah, who is it? Sorry about that. Yeah. Yeah. Nah, bro, I have no idea. Like, um, I don't know. You seem like, based on that punching video, you seem like cooler with it. Mm. Like, you seem more relaxed. Cole seems like he'd be a bit fidgety. I think he mm. would, Girls would like work the crowd better. <laughs> they would better. like that. Yeah, yeah maybe. Crowd controller. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you joking? I He's didn't... introverted as fuck. Am I? Yeah. Maybe. I don't know, man. I don't know. Jack's, oh, every time I see Jack, he's like, just very yeah, no, no, no. You, yeah, but you want a little fucking Jack Russell going about and just doing all this yeah, shit, bro. No, you'd get fired. You wanna add, like, we want to like. I'm if I'm the woman. I want. I want you to add like you've been here before. Mm. Oh, Why yeah. are you so eager? Yeah. Like, mm. What's all this yeah. nervous energy? Yeah, you get mm. sacked first day. Yeah, 100%, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%, you get sacked first day. Jack will play cool. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I would. I actually cool. would. Yeah. So how much would you get from one of these gigs, roughly? 50 pound a pop. So an hour. hour. Yeah, so how many hours? Like three hours. Yeah, two, max three hours. 50 quid. Yeah, so like, that. Two, yeah, like what? Uh, 150, 200 quid. That's yeah. good. Not bad. This is like 12 years ago. Yeah, you wow. get paid every other week. So it was good money at the time. How, how often did you do it? Whenever there was a gig, every to be weekend, honest. Pretty yeah. Almost every weekend. Really? Yeah. yeah. And that was your money maker while you were at uni. That's, we that's how we made money at uni, yeah. That's mad. Right, well, Go. okay, we talked about Okay. Let's get back into this boxing thing. Yes. I don't know whether you've heard about this. Mm. Ryan Garcia. Yes. You've oh, seen the this Bohemian shit. Grove thing. Bro. The what? Yeah. Bohemian Grove. You don't know about this. I'll let you. What? Did he get invited to Bohemian Grove? Bro, more <laughs> weird that? than that. So you know Ryan Garcia, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know kind Ryan. Of, kind of. Yeah. Boxer. Boxing, very, boxer. Very, very talented guy. Sure. Walter Waite? The young guy. Uh, uh, yeah, he's, like, he's like quite... Middle, something. Yeah, yeah. He's quite a small guy, but he's yeah. quick. Heard of him. Uh, anyway, so he's a very talented boxer, has like great prospects of becoming the best, whatever. Uh, he's recently come out saying um, he's been exposing like the Illuminati oh, shit. and saying it's true. Uh, and if I die... Uh, all I care about is releasing the truth. Yeah. Oh my God. Um, and he says he feels like he's going to die. And if he does, it's not him. Someone's killed him. He had a call with Andrew and Tristan Tate as well to talk about mm -hmm. it. And he was saying, I'm a God, they can't beat me. And Andrew was like, you're really fucking up here. Mm. You're in trouble. You're in big trouble with what you're releasing. Don't say it because you're not as powerful as you think kind of thing. But he, he, he basically goes on to say, uh, one of it is like Bohemian Grove. Do you know much about Bohemian no. Grove? Oh, yeah, Bohemian Grove is like, isn't that where like they all dress up like wizards and like I read up. Um, I've heard that mm. child, like child sacrifice and blood. In there, right. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So, so Bohemian Grove is basically uh, a club for the elites. Now it used to be a conspiracy, um, but it is true. Can we go back onto those images uh, quickly? Is it Alex Jones that out? Alex Jones. Yeah. But then. Uh, a YouTuber, so yeah, these are like pictures of it. They're real. So the presidents, the 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 elites, like the wealthiest people, would go to this thing, and uh, it was so th they've got an owl statue called um, Moloch, I think something like that. It is a uh, yeah Moloch or M yes Moloch, something, like, yeah, something yeah. like that. But um, the whole ceremony, you see that owl there with the fire. Yeah. The whole ceremony is they get an effigy of a child. What's that mean? So it's like a, a, made, out of, sticks, a made out of sticks yeah. and they put it in front of the owl and they chant and shit and then they set it on fire. That's 
fucking and this is bear in mind these are the people that run countries these are fucking freaks and anyway so 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 no one <laughs> believed in no one believed in this stuff but like you said alex jones went to it yeah and it released footage this youtuber recently went this is footage of the real place uh you can see like the owl and stuff that's the owl is that the owl there? where's it located <clears throat> people America. should go there and just like burn you can't, it down well you can't just go there they did a documentary about it and uh they tried to get in and they called the police like they would not let me in here's here's one of the ceremonies can you put the sound up as well please like really which i mean yeah the top comment there with all the technology we have today never is there any clear footage or anyone else's real name exposed. The, because, it looks like it's filmed on a fucking potato. Well, the thing you have to remember is these are the biggest, most powerful people in the world. So Carl. why are they doing this? And how did this person get this footage? How is he Alex, in there? He managed to sneak in somehow because it's in a big plot of land, but it's very hard to get in. Will they kill you? Well, this is where I'm getting to. What are they doing though? It's Why mad, are they doing this? Why? But it, there's pictures of our, pre well, not ours, the American presidents and the most powerful people in the world at this place. Yeah. So, so people, you, you know, you yeah. don't know what- Tom Hanks is apparently a uh, pretty fiddler. But anyway, so Ryan Allegedly. Garcia, Ryan Garcia has come out as saying um, he was taken to Bohemian Grove, uh, tied up and made to watch them fiddle with kids and do shit to kids. No way. Yeah. Crazy. Really? Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Everyone at the minute, like it's all his social media is about this. Whoa. He's saying he's saying he's found out like these elites know everything. They're the most powerful people on earth. And it's crazy that no one really knows about it because it's so secretive. Like yeah. and how do they keep it that secretive? Do you know what I mean? Yeah, but the people that do know about it, like mm. Just brush it under the rug. Like you've just heard that now. What we're gonna do? We're not gonna, we can't no, do anything yeah. Oh, yeah. because yeah. But okay, right. So if you're in a, if you're at this thing and you're seeing something happen to a kid, right? If you expose it, they're gonna kill you. They could kill you so easily. How? Because they're the most powerful people on the planet. How? Yeah. How are they gonna kill me, bro? You send a guy around your house immediately. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. literally, yeah. literally, literally, literally. <laughs> oh, really? I don't know. Don't know if you man remember there was a lawyer. That um, in America, a like a uh, FedEx um, driver came up to the door, pretending to be a FedEx driver, but it was, it was a he was a, an assassin. Mm -hmm. He went to shoot the lawyer, but killed the family instead, and not been spoken about since. Like there was nothing. When was this? This was a couple years ago, maybe three years ago. It's crazy. What do you mean he he killed the family instead? What do you mean? What was the lawyer working on? Like I can't. It was something. It. it was something big. I can't remember what it was, but yeah. the fact that that can just happen mm. casually. Yeah. yeah, bro. But what, what we need to remember as well is the people that go to this thing are the people that run all the media. They yeah. run everything. And he talks about how in, in these big elite circles, right? Similar. Oh, yeah, so the Epstein trial, that was it. Gunman kills the son of the judge, overseeing judge. No way. Whoa. On the Epstein trial. Yeah. He was trying to kill the judge of the Epstein trial. Yeah, bro. This, this, this is no joke, bro. And he, but, he, he pulled up as like a FedEx driver or something. Oh my yeah. god. Bro, you don't realize how powerful these people are, man. It's, it's crazy. so fucked. But man. but anyway, Ryan Garcia, he's trying to obviously expose all this shit. Um Good. but he's also saying, but it's not just him. So many people in Hollywood at the moment are saying, bro, the Illuminati type yeah. thing is real. Like they will get you to try and sign away. Do you see David Dobrik talks about it as well? Really? Bro, did you not see that? Bro, yeah, that was bro. crazy. That. So he talks about it on a podcast. He said he's been scared to talk about it for like ever. Jack's locked the fuck in, by the way. Bro. You're yeah. cooking today, bro. Yeah, he's he's did, man. Yeah. Bro, I, when I saw this stuff, I, ha I had to look into it because yeah. I was like, I thought the guy was going crazy. But genuinely, what he's talking about is like, it's real shit. Uh, but anyway, so David Dobrik, he used to live with this girl who's like an up and coming singer. And he spoke about this on a pod. And he said... Uh, she was approached by these guys and uh, they took her aside in suits and all, the, all this shit. And they said to her, look, we can make you whatever you want to be. You want to be famous, we can do it. You want to be rich, we can do it. But to do it, you need to kill your family member. And apparently she had this conversation and her mum was like willing to do it and all this shit. I and then, die, and then and then she <sighs> said, yeah, I'm pretty sure. We, we might be able to get the clip up, but... Uh, she then told David, 
And she was like, if I, t- they tell me if I tell anyone, they'll kill me like that. So she told David and he said he's been keeping this secret for years. And he's Wait, only- so they said, if you kill, if you tell anyone, you'll be killed. So she told someone. <laughs> Apparently, yeah. <It's> smart. <laughs> yeah, of all people, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, um, but yeah, that's fucked. I've actually got another one that links into this. Okay. And this is, this happened very recently. So do you know Boeing? No, I didn't know. But the, the, the planes. The planes. Oh, I heard something about this. Right. Well, uh, so they, they're like the third biggest like export in America, right? They don't just do planes. They do like um, uh, military. They're like yeah, they huge. Rockets and stuff. Oh, okay. They're the number yeah. one supplier for the military. So they okay. give the rockets, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so there was this guy that worked there for like 25 years and he was in charge of like quality assurance or whatever. And he noticed that they were just skipping loads of steps in like when the plane's manufacturing and all all this shit. Yeah. Uh, But they weren't listening to him and they were like, oh, we don't give a shit. And he said like, when you fly a plane, you know, when it comes into the emergency and those things come down, he said, most of them don't work. And, really? and they just, cause they didn't give a shit. Cause they're going to die anyway. Yeah. So they, they don't give a shit. So they just didn't bother f- like doing them properly. Anyway, oh my God. he left Boeing and started releasing all this stuff. He became a whistleblower for Boeing. Right. And there was a, yeah. And there was a recent testimony on it. And the day before he was due in court to give his evidence, uh, he was found shot dead outside his hotel room. Oh, I hate this insane. fucking world. Him? Yeah, John Barnett found dead, yeah. Wow. Apparently so, self so, Oh, I saw but, that, yeah. But so. everyone's saying that the gunshot wounds, it doesn't make sense that it's self-inflicted. Mm-hmm. And oh. also, why would he do it? Yeah. yeah. Like, if you're going to trial... The self-inflicted, next- my arsehole. Crazy, bro. <clears throat> Damn. Jeez, yeah, bro. conspiracy is crazy. Yeah. Boeing denied both claims. Of course they did. Yeah, man. Bastards. It's, crazy. it's scary. Like, I, I'm, I, I'm like one of those people that don't believe in all this conspiracy bullshit. But when I started looking into this stuff, I was like, how, is, how is that real? Yeah. I do believe that conspiracy stuff. Yeah, some of them. Some of them. Some a lot of them. them. 9-11 and all that. Either way. Um, let's, <laughs> let's move on juicy. to, that juicy. huh? So that was juicy. juicy. Sorry. Mm. Thank you. That was, wasn't it? I was locked in. That was yeah. nice. Well done, Jay. Cheers, that was man. good. It was good stuff. He hasn't done that in a while. It's good. No, well, I, this Ryan Garcia thing literally made me like, well, I'm going to look him up. W- watch the videos of him. It's weird. Mm. And then it, on, on, he was live, uh, on TikTok and that talking about it. And, uh, you can see these like people in the background and, uh, he he starts talking about he's like also they know how to time travel all this bullshit they've got documents on aliens and all this bollocks and uh this guy next to him is like right i'm stopping the lie i'm stopping the lie it's weird also as well um with that <laughs> no, I had something. I, no, no. <laughs> Trailer four is gone. No, no. Okay, I got something. No, no. So, have you seen? Oh, yeah. Obviously, they're trying to ban TikTok in America now, right? Oh, yeah. Again. Oh, okay. But that's that's because obviously TikTok has got. Are you holding in a yawn? Yes. <laughs> Good. Perception. Being clocked holding in a yawn is crazy. Oh, he's holding in a yawn. I think as soon as I start already. talking, as soon as I start talking. <laughs> <laughs> and you was like, yep. Yeah, yeah, bro, I was, I was yeah. Yeah. His oh nose God. was flaring yeah. and I was thinking, what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Clocked it. Oh, so wow. Sorry, bro. No, I'm, I'm interested. Fine. Go on. Are you? TikTok, mm-hmm. America. Yeah. Please go. No, this is the last thing, right? All right. Until we get into the game. All but right. Cool, cool, cool. They're trying to ban uh, TikTok in America and people mm-hmm. are saying, oh, because they can't control it because all this information... I'm not holding in anything. <laughs> I'm just black. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm not supposed to just look like that. Oh, okay, fine. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, all this information gets around really quick. Everyone's yeah, yeah, starting yeah. to realise all government control and shit. And I yeah. don't know if you saw this one thing where uh, this guy was doing uh, TikToks and he filmed the top of a mountain. And you, in, this t- uh, in this TikTok, you can see this big giant yes. in, on the mountain, yes. right? And then he kept on doing these series of videos, going into the woods and stuff, being like, I'm, I swear there's like, there's people out, there's huge giants out there somewhere. Okay. Mm. And he keeps on trying to go and find them and film and he, he filmed them again. You just see this like big giant on top of this mountain ages away. Mm. Um, and then his girlfriend posted, like there was, these are getting millions of views. And then his girlfriend posted, oh, he's been killed. 
this guy who's documenting these these giants has been killed. Can't remember his name now. What? Mm. Mental. Yeah, I remember that. It's mental. Was what? that was that uh did that Love come out as not true so though? It might Love have been not conspiracy. True, yeah. That one could have easily been, been a, though. Yeah, yeah. Like, he could have been playing. Yeah. But it, it, oh, it happened. Sure. Yeah. I mean, even didn't Grace have people locked in on their little yes. UFO thing? Yes. Mm. Did she get you? What's that? Nah. She kind of. <laughs> <laughs> um, she, got, she did like yeah. a TikTok a little while ago. And then was like, what was it? Like a flash and like a little... It was this a flash oh, that stopped yeah, in the middle yeah, yeah. of the screen. Wasn't that for like a TV show or something? I don't even know what it was for. Yeah, I think it was. But I think, believed, yeah. It went viral and everyone believed that there was like a proper UFO. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah. So this is Mr. and Mr. with Cole, Anderson, James. Jack, Jack Joseph. Fu and James. So James and Fuhad, they're on one team. Me and Jack are on the other. And our producer for today is going to read out some questions this is a head-to-head -head, low iq versus shits and gigs yep nice, nice. we like these mm. you like these yeah, yeah, yeah do you yeah, think yeah. you know each other well we know each other very yeah. well yeah. Mm. Yeah. it's like you finish each other's sentences Ooh. Mid, mid, mid. yeah i was gonna say yeah. kicking the mitzvah race guy out <laughs> 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 right okay so please mr producer say so wait are we gonna shall i just explain, yeah, explain we're gonna yeah, hold yeah. up all right so jack go Okay, so the way this works, we've got three rounds with three questions in each round. Uh, for each question, we've got to decide either ourselves or our partner. And, we, and if we both get it right, then we get a point. Partner. Well, it's a partner, isn't it? What I else? I suppose. All right. Friend. friend. All right, friend. Let's go friend. All right, let's go friend. Your friend. You're not partners. Partner. Partner. All right, well, fucking oh, partner yes, then. Fine, no, go yeah. on then. Friends if you you want. can be a fax. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. Fre uh, partner. <laughs> 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 partner, yeah. Okay, go. <clears throat> okay, so round one. Yes. First question. Who is funnier? Hmm. Now, now I, I suppose we've got to think what our partner would say, right? Or do, are we doing uh, just what we just think? Just what we think. Just who, who do you think? Yeah. Right. Three... Two, one. Oh, oh, what? Oh, we all said each other, didn't we? Who did you? Wait, why are you, why are you holding up two? Which one are you showing? Which one are you showing? Show oh, showing both. Like, no, 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 you can't. No, you can't. Oh, that's a, you can't. That's, that's two funny. points taken off. That's <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. brilliant. Actually, it's funny. That well, is, no, no, yes. we win a point because you can hold up two. Yeah. What? You can't hold up two, well, mate. You, we were holding. We've got zero anyway, so it doesn't matter. We all got oh, yeah. zero. Oh, we got okay, zero. Okay, we, we all got zero. Yeah. The future, though. Yeah. Cool. yeah. <laughs> Do you know how this game works? Okay. <laughs> I Next. thought you would have said yourself for that. No. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> the numbers won't die. <laughs> <laughs> what did he say? Straight over yeah. his head. <laughs> I've seen the rules of the numbers. <laughs> yeah. Okay, next question. Okay, question two. Who has more money? Mm. Mm. It's a tough one. Okay. Okay, are we ready? Yeah. yeah. Three, two, one. Shall we? Nice. Right, yeah. We mm. oh, 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 one oh, point. So one point wait, for the Spotify listeners, by the way. Me and Jack both said Jack, Fuhad and James both said Fuhad. Mm, okay. Nice. How do you know that? How would that work? Because you both did the same thing. Yeah, because yeah. I spend. Oh. Oh. Fuhad's a really sensible saver. Who? I'm only really? a sensible oh. saver because of, I was going to say something so obnoxious. Go on. No, 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 go on. Because <laughs> you earn so much. <laughs> I was going to say I'm only a sensible saver because I have enough money to save now. Mm. As opposed to... When I was on like, an, I say nine to five, but like when I was working normally, mm. yeah, I, I was hardly saved. Do you save though? Because I yeah, don't I save. Do. I actually do save. Because yeah, you're really good at saving. Yeah. I'm terrible at saving. I actually really do save. Now. Yeah, but the thing is, I don't save and neither do you, but we just don't buy shit. Well, we don't call well, it saving. I know, but it's it's not like- You're I'm, not actively I'm, saving. I'm not actively yeah, saving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, count me out though, I save. You don't need to save. Right. What the fuck? No, 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 I'm saying. Yeah, everyone no. needs to say, Jeff Bezos say it. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay, fine, sure. So one, one, one each. One all. One yeah. all. all right, we're doing all right. Next question. Right, one all. Last one of this round. Who is more vain or cares more about their appearance? Huh. That's an interesting one. Mm. <laughs> 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 okay, ready? Count yeah. us down. Okay, three, two, one, show. Uh, I know it's but anyway. Fuhad, right. Oh. Really? I, I would say yeah. Yeah. So, really? so uh, James and Fuhad voted Fuhad both, both of them, for, and then Jack and me voted me. Mm. Um, oh, it's 2-2. Two, 2-2. Two. Two, two, two. Two, two. Okay, why do you think Fuhad's... Uh... He cares more about parents? Yeah. 
Um, it's, it's not that he cares more about appearance. He's just he's better just looking. Inve- <laughs> that for one. And he's more invested. So whenever we have like a photo shoot or if we're working with a stylist mm. or whatever, like Fresh. Fuad will get involved in it. Yeah. Oh, really? And I'm just like, get this over with. Yeah. Like, I don't like, oh. I, hate, I fucking hate Really? It. So yeah, it's, mm. he doesn't care more about his appearance, but like in that aspect of like, in a vanity aspect, yeah. he can buy into it more than I can. You got great mm. skin. Thank you, sir. He does have great mm. skin. You both do, to be fair. You do as well. Do I? Hmm. So That's you, good. Bro. Cheers, mate. Yeah, yeah, you do. We all- <laughs> <laughs> Was waiting for that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> next, last one of this round. round to <laughs> one person <laughs> <to> say it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, round two. Round two. Okay, so that's two all. Round two. First question is, who has the worst habit? Oh. Uh, hold on. <laughs> oh, now that's a toughie, mm. isn't it? We've both got bad habits. We've both got bad habits. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, I'm I'm ready for the thingy. Yeah, Are you guys ready? ready? Oh shit! I think. Um, I... Oh, this is worse. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I think habits. Three. Are I'm thinking. Yeah. yeah. But I'm still gonna go with my choice. Okay. Three, two, one. Show. Yeah. 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 So everyone got it right again. Why? Why has Fu had got the bad? What is habit? it? What is um, it? I know what you got. Sleep, yeah. So sleep so, and so, hunger. Yeah, he's anemic and he won't admit. You're so, anemic? Yeah, so like he sleep, he never gets enough sleep, but he does. Like he can sleep 10 hours and still be exhausted. Mm. And like oh, really? his hunger, hunger controls me. his hunger is like a, a vampire's hunger. Like if yeah. he's hungry, he can't function. He can't think. Really? He can't yeah. Talk, mm. can't, so yeah, yeah if, if, it, if you guys wanted us here for four o'clock and it was 4.02 and he was hungry, we would We'd get be here at 4.30. at 4.30 once he's eaten. Really? For real? Yeah. We've learned. I wouldn't be just, able to record. Yeah, 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 yeah. I promise you. What would you do? I would. I wouldn't be able to record, bro. Like I wouldn't give my all. Sit here and silence. I'd sit here and just. Like, huh. Really? Yeah, oh. Bro, I need food. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Box him up. I need time. food. Yeah. Okay. What's your What's your habit, James? Do you have a habit? You know what? Um, I would say his bad habit is. Doesn't. Um, the authority thing, like oh, he doesn't, yeah. doesn't I like bad. I have, um, you don't people, take, he doesn't do like well orders. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. really bad. Uh, but I don't oh, think really? his is more as heightened as mine because the likelihood of his happening is less. Yeah, yeah my sense. authority issue is yeah. less frequent. Than less frequent than my hunger at times. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I went for that one. That's yeah, kind of the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah well, sorry, good. Yeah. Right, what about you guys? Jack, what's my one? What's my bad habit? Well, I know you, yeah. Well, I think so, go on. You definitely know what it is because you did it today. Uh, so Cole's bad habit is eating other people's food. To, oh yeah, and that yeah, I don't do that. Carry on. Rude. But um, time management. He is the worst. So you Fuck don't that, bro. Man. It like, is bad. I hate that. No, do you know? Do you that. know how bad it is today? Right. So we've got a group chat. We should get this on screen. His messages for in we'll just post do it later. Yeah, later. But mm. don't need to do. So it. he messaged me yesterday. <laughs> He messaged me yesterday saying, Jack, we've got to get there an hour early because we need to plan. We've got some other stuff we're doing together. We've got a plan. So he said, be there by half two. And I said, all right. Uh, I don't think, I'm early to shit all the time. And I said- no, you're fucking not. I am. I'm Carry either on. early, I'm never late. Go on. But, so I said to him, like, you, you shouldn't be the one telling me to be early because you're the, he's late every episode, genuinely. It's anyway. Stereotypes, bro. So, so today I- I, I, I messaged a chat at half two saying, oh, I'm, t- um, I'm here basically and five minutes away. He messages back, why the fuck are you so early? <laughs> oh, I mean, that's oh, a piss take. Yeah. Yeah. I forgot. There's being late and there's not even knowing you're late. That's a fucking job. Do you know how late he was? An hour, 45 minutes. Bro, that's not funny. Bro. Hour and a half. Hour, that's, that's, oh yeah, an hour and a half. Shit. <laughs> hour and a half. No, it, no, I'm not late because in my head, I thought it was 3.30 I was getting here. So that's what I'm saying. Time management is bad. It is bad. Very bad. It is oh, bad. No, no, but I'm usually only- That needs time management. That's yeah. like just basic organization. Yeah, I know, but no, that's forgetfulness. Okay, and that, mm. yeah. Because I forgot I we was had, getting We also two. had a sidemen shoot and I was on my way. We, we, I was due there in like half an hour, right? And uh, I ring him. He's not picking up. He's not picking up. And finally picks up. I'm like, uh, where the fuck are you? Oh, I just woke up. Yeah, no, that, no, mention. that I fucking murder you, bro. That is because my alarm didn't go off. <laughs> it's what bad all the you? time. Uh, it was, <laughs> it was, was it? No, no, probably. No, it was, it was like midday. It wasn't early. Jesus no, God. it was two hours away from me. All right. Same either way, me, but... either way. Wow. Uh, yeah, I got there late for that one, but that's that's forgetfulness as well. 
I'm angry on Jack's behalf. I'm not Sorry. Uh, so the thing is, I think your habit's worse than mine. Oh, Jack's but, is like. But I just knew he'd put me. What's your habit? J Jack's I'd is, say. Well, let me say. Yeah. Vaping and snooze. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty bad. I don't vape anymore, though. He doesn't vape anymore, so snooze. But yeah. snooze was to get me off the vape. Fair. And that's also like just self-inflicted. That doesn't affect anyone else. Mm. Yeah, that's yeah, true. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, true. Yeah, yeah. Okay, last round. Or well, round two, right? Yeah. yeah. Last round? This is wholesome. Ra mm. Round two, second question, Cole. Okay. Uh, okay, so who leaves the night out first? Easy. Mm, easy. Oh, yeah. Easy? Yep. Yeah. Um. Oh, I don't know. I don't think it's easy. Is it? Mm, who leaves the easy. night out first? Oh, actually, maybe it's not easy. No, it's not easy. Sorry, fellas. Uh, oh, oh shit. Oh, shit. Shit, we need to get this right. Yeah, we really know each other. Get a few more years under your belt, man. Um, oh. Hold on. Uh, no, yeah, first. Mm, okay, I've got mine. Okay. Yeah, I've got mine. Yeah, ready? All right, then. Three, two, one, show. Fuck. Amateurs. I didn't no. Need, I didn't need to check his uh, card. So, Jack put me. I put Jack. Fuhad put Fuhad. James put Fuhad. Ah. Why'd you put me? See, the thing is, we talked about this on like two episodes ago. But I, 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 I hate going out. I know. But when I start drinking. You're right. Yeah, that's true. I don't want to go. And you're always, you, you, well, I wouldn't say you want to go. I never go. No, you don't. But I'd say. I, yeah, I guess. You want to stay out longer, I guess. Mm. Yeah. Okay, you boys? Mm. Um, more time we're in a group, I just. He just yeah, probably, once he's had enough, he's had yeah. enough. I'm like, you know, once I start drinking, yeah. well, I'm I can, hungry. Yeah. I can go and go and go and true, go. True, true. Once I start drinking, yeah. I can just true. go up and go. I get fed. If I'm hungry, obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 As soon as he gets hungry, he came over. Mm. Yeah. Do you, get, do you yeah. have a low social battery? I have a low social battery. <sighs> Bro, same. Mine is bad. Mm. I wouldn't say it's low, but it's, it's not the greatest. Mine's medium, yeah. I guess. I Actually, think you've seen mine, mine be quite. Yeah, if we're yeah. at events and stuff and people are, I'm just like, oh, fuck off. <laughs> yeah. Like, it depends yeah, who it I'm does. with. Yeah. If I'm with, like, my close mates, my battery's just all night. But yeah, if yeah, I'm yeah. around new people, I'm just like, oh. It's, it's the new people's the one. Mm. Yeah, it's just yeah, small talk all the time, isn't it? It's shit. It is. um, all right. Last Next question. Yeah. All right, last one of this round. Who's more likely to join a cult? Oh, yeah. Interesting. Yeah, I think I've got this one. Right, okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So that is Ready? four three, by the way. Oh, it's four oh, three. Shit. Yeah. It's okay. Four, okay. To to Fuhad and James. Oh, mm -hmm. well, I don't know this one. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Three, two, one. Show. Oh uh, yeah, Cole. Ah oh, shit. Yes. shit. No, no. What? What do you mean? Shit. No, they've done. They've gotten. Uh, oh. I need but, to look. Yeah. Mm. James has put James. Fuhad Your, has put yeah, James. Yours is what. That's obvious. I mean, three, right. that's, Why? I only wrote. I only gave James because I thought you were going to give James, but I don't know why I'm more likely to join a couple. I just feel like. Dependent, I feel like you're just more susceptible. I get excited about it. Yeah, you. exactly. Yeah, and I thought, that's what I thought you were going to yeah. say. And I'm just, I'd, I would just charge it. I'm yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I would say no from the jump. Yeah. And he yeah. would probably like really try and egg me onto it. They could chuck yeah. me into it. Yeah, exactly. Because if they were just like, yeah. oh, there's like water slides and like, <laughs> you know, like <laughs> what? that's it. <laughs> you're going to Bohemian fucking Grove for a water slide. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bohemian Grove literally has like paintball, water slides, like pod tournaments, all that kind of shit. Bro, it sounds pretty sick. Yeah. Okay, why am I? Because I thought well, you you're me. you're just you believe everything you see. No, no, I don't. So someone could ease. You're easily manipulatable. Mad. It trends with the hi hypnosis. Mm. No, 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 it's, no. It doesn't trend. With the, no, it doesn't trend with the hypnosis because I at the hypnosis. I I purposely listen loads because I haven't got good listening ears. Yeah. I listened it loads on it, and I wanted to do it because I was like, this isn't shit, bro. Mm. Okay. So that, that proves the point though, because you tried your hardest not exactly. to get hypnotized. No, no, no. I tried my hardest to get hypnotized. Oh, I see. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I see. Yeah? Yeah. All right. But I think Jack just thinks I'm stupid. That's why I'll do it. <laughs> right. Um, last round. Okay, last round. Round three. First question is, who is more likely to have a weird fetish? Yeah. Yeah, I got it. A weird quick. fetish. Let me win. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All clued in. Three, two, one, show. Yes! Whoa! <laughs> no, what the <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, oh, mate, God. you do some weird shit. <laughs> no, God. You do some weird shit, mate. <laughs> oh, oh, that's ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. that's hilarious. So oh, basically, God. what just happened for the Spotify user? Uh, Foo had put James. Yeah, James put Foo had. And then Jack put me and I put Jack. 
What? What? what Why the did you hell? say yes then? What? Because we looked at yours. I oh. thought it was self-explanatory that it's cold. That's insane. <laughs> no, mate. What would give you the impression I'm a fetish man? Because you're more like you're more into that kind of stuff. What, sexual. Yeah, you talk very sexual all the time. Yeah, but I don't have fetishes, mate. You probably have some. Do you? Okay, so you Seems guys like, explain. I just, I just booked James because I couldn't think of one for myself. Mm. So okay, this James. Is like, um, what's the word? Um, process of elimination. Mm. So I put you just because freaky boy, kinky. I don't know. I think we're kind of on the same level, you know. Mm. You're not into the the like over. No, I don't like. We've spoke about. I wish I did have a fetish. I do. I think that was what's your fetish? Fetish seemed no, no. I meant I wish I did. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. To be fair, I spoke to my mate recently, and he said he met this girl right, and like the first date, they you know went back, and uh, she was like quite an innocent person, right. And apparently she like opened the drawer and there was like crazy stuff in there. And she asked him to uh, lay like this, like in doggy, and she wanted to spank him loads. I see, nah, that's ridiculous. That's kind of That was her fetish. Sus. Mm. Sus. He didn't like it. Oh, he did it? Yeah. A couple slaps, he said. Just don't do it. Just don't do it. Yeah. Damn. Either way. Okay, next question. Okay, next question. Who makes a better prime minister? Mm -hmm. Cool. Mm. <laughs> is that another quick one yep. yeah 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 i got it yeah all right three two one show nice okay no. but all, all one there yeah okay. so what's the score now five four in it or yeah, six, five? Five, four. Five, six four. five but yeah they're one up right so it's all down up. to this last question so that's this last question of round three and the last one is who's Don't got the best please. riz who's got the best riz Okay. Interesting. That's interesting. That we can win it here. We can win it here, Jack. It's different. Different it styles of riz. We got different styles. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. What, the <laughs> best? Yeah, yeah. No, no, you, <laughs> who's got the best? No good fairies. <laughs> no looking at each other's things. Mm. I think we got to get a countdown on this. Yeah. Okay. Three, two, one, show. <gasps> yeah! Yes! I was yes! Yes! Oh, yes. Sorry, bro. I switched. <laughs> oh. Yes. Yeah. Well, well done, Jack. Come on, we drew. Well, we drew. <laughs> like you get gas for all of them. Yeah, that's like, sick. After nah. all that, you have drawn six, six all. Mm. Yeah, that's sick. Yeah, I'm happy with that, mate. Yeah, I'm happy, I'm happy with, with a draw. That was a good. That was, that was good. good. Yeah, yeah, we're losing. Well done. Yeah, yeah I'd yeah. say you have the best yeah. risk. You, indeed. Yeah, yeah, I'm good at that. You're good at. You're good at. You're, you've got good charisma, I'd say. Oh, thank you very much. Yeah. You got good. Uh, it's alright. Yeah. No, you have as well. You have. Well, yeah, but you. I think you need more confidence. Yeah. Do you like confidence? Uh, well, no, I'm not risen up. I've got a girlfriend, so I'm not, I don't think you would have seen my riz, really. Yeah, you wouldn't have seen my riz, I guess, but... No, I just... have. <laughs> <You're> like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he hasn't, though. It's a joke. Uh, no, fair enough. Yeah. Um, what about you guys? What, who, why do you pick each other? Um, it's just the styles are different. Styles are very different, yeah. Um, okay. But like... Different formations on the team. Like, who yeah. has like... I don't know. I would have... The reason I said you mm. is because, like, I've seen you win girls over. Mm. Mm. Girls oh, yeah. that I've got usually fancy me before. Okay. Ooh, <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. He's you know saying I mean? he's better I, looking than. No, no, it's hear, not even about looking. I hear what looking. you're saying, though. I hear what you're it's saying. It's just like, it? yeah, like, I would never, there's never ever in our, like, I'm, like, socially, I, I can't just talk mm, to talk a stranger. To girls, yeah. mm. So, like, in order for me to talk to a girl, mm. I've already seen her looking at me. So I'm like, mm. all right. Oh, cool. yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Whereas yeah. like, if I can see a girl and she's like, she's banging, I'm going to talk to her. Oh, really? That, yeah, okay. It's not me at yeah. all. Yeah, no, nah, I'm, I'm with you on that, yeah, James. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that's what why you... I said it was you. About, the reason why oh. I said it was you because of what you said earlier about yourself. Do you see what I'm saying? Like a girl will come up or like, he will see a girl from afar and the connection is just then they just straight. Yeah, do you that, see what I'm saying? Oh, really? yeah, 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 so mutual it's a mutual thing. thing yeah. yeah. Mm. So you can just go up to a girl and chat her up? rarely yeah like, but you have can to be in like the zone, zone. Yeah, yeah exactly bro i'm i couldn't I, I don't think i've ever done that ever i've never gone it's up rare to a girl for me it is rare yeah. for, rare you. for me work. <laughs> i'm like damn yeah yeah <laughs> really? impressive yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. you got go. back in back in the day um would i yeah yeah i'd be in the zone i'd have to have a few drinks though and mm. and, and slightly know that if she's looked at me once then i'll be like I, i'd stare at her i'd look at a good looking girl i'd stare at her <laughs> and, I would wait, and I would wait until I caught her eye, even if it was just a quick glance. Be like, all right, I'm over, mm. right? And then I'd, 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 I'd go next to them and pretend like I don't see them. Mm. Maybe I'd like bump into them and be like, oh, what are "You saying, girl?" I wouldn't say that, <laughs> but and then it would work. 
right, cool. So, would you yeah. use a chat up line or would you just, nah, you just, just conversation? Mm. Yeah, yeah, combo, combo. How do you, how do you start? It depends on the situation, bro. Um, if I'm probably seeing a girl, I, to be fair, I'll compliment her. I think that's just a- 10 out of 10, she's at the bar, she's getting a drink. She's about to move away. Yeah. Mm. But I'll probably say something right. Sorry to disturb you. You smell fucking banging, by smells the way. Smells a good one. That's Why a good, smell good. fucking good banging. Okay, let's, let's, let's reenact this. I'm a girl. All right, so you're about to leave the bar, right? Yeah, right. Okay, you be the barman. Yeah. yeah. You pass me this. Okay, ready? Here we go. Yeah. I'm okay, cool. uh, and this is your drink, uh, you. lady. Half drunk Corona. Yeah, there yeah. you go. Yeah. Cheers. Thank off you, you go. I'm going now. So a bit tall. just go in there. Yeah. I'm off. I'm out of the club. What the fuck? He's going to be miserable. We're game planning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three up, three up. I said I'm out of the club. Go again. Yeah, All right. Okay. He's right. off. She's off. Good luck. Okay. See you thank later, you. madam. Thank you. Good morrow. Good. See you later. Real quick, real quick, real quick. Sorry, sorry, sorry. My bad. Sorry to disturb you. I just want to let you know. Yeah. You smell fucking amazing. Do I? I don't know what you're wearing, but I love it. I'll look at it and I'll crack on. Oh, that's it. Then, okay. I'll let go. And, no, I'll let go and crack on. I'll just crack. Like I'll keep um, ordering my drink or whatever. But that's left the impression. It's very but good. What if they don't smell good? Would you? Say? You like? Oh no, no, no. I don't like. Would, if I, you if I like. genuinely feel like they smell good, I will tell them they smell. What good. What if she smells like bo? What would your game plan be then? Um, I would probably smell it before I chat to her. Oh, so then you then a bought mission. It's, it's what about a breath? Oh, big one. Mm. Big big one. Big one. Oh, she opens her mouth and then you're like, ooh. Um, like twice. I'd go. You I'm just out. go I, I, straight away. No, I'd be like, I, my mates, I think. Uh, I'd probably like, name? yeah, I would start a conversation and then like chit chat, chit chat, whatever. I'm like, oh, just, I'm going to go meet my friends. I'm going go to go, I'll say I'm going to the toilet. That's it. Toilet. Really? In a dance, going to the toilet. I'll catch you in a bit, going to the toilet. She goes in for the kiss. <laughs> oh, oh, that's insane. No, she wouldn't. Not just in the first scenario. No, nah, no. Nah, first nah. encounter? Improv. Nah, impossible. Improv. Have right. you ever done that on a date? You ever ditched a date? I've um, I've never ditched. No, I've never ditched a date. No, I, would, I, would. I, feel, I feel too bad. I think. Yeah, I feel yeah. bad. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's, that's I'd, bad I, mind. I'd grind through it. Like, mm. yeah. Okay. Well, Ooh. that is the end Sick. of the episode, guys. Thank you very much for coming on. Thank what do you, you want to say to the cameras um, and everyone, the audience? Cheers for having us. Um, Thanks, congrats on the new set. Thank yeah, love nice. the set. Thank you very much. Um, Good portrait. Yeah, man. Yeah. This yeah. was a really Sick. fun episode. It was. You know, you know, the last time you came on as well, just been finished with this. Is um, a lot of your fans came over just to watch you. Yeah. And then we got a lot of, uh, we got a few comments that were like, these boys are not it, but we're just here for James at Foo. Mm, if you cool. say that again, <laughs> <laughs> look, just, just show love, mate. All right? You don't have to watch us. In this, man. Yeah, in this one, I think you guys really held your own. Yeah. Mm. yeah. You really, really did a good yeah. job. Um, and actually, that's kind of rare um, for people to invite us on and actually carry a conversation. Mm. It, it's oh. super comfortable. So well done. Mm. Oh, Really that, there you go, there guys. You go. Just listen so, to them. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for having us, man. Do and, you want to um, plug your stuff? I was going to say you could plug to. your show, but you sold out, haven't you? Yeah. It's yeah no really 200 sorry, tickets done. left. Yeah. You want them? They're probably gone by now. Yeah. yeah. So unlucky. Yeah, but now we're good. We're just happy to be here. Fuck. Good. I appreciate you coming on. See you later, everybody. Gang. Bye bye. Bye.